Eight people have died and more than a dozen people have been taken to the hospital after a tractor trailer collided with a Greyhound bus headed to Phoenix. American Red Cross volunteers from Southern Arizona are responding to the situation. News 4 Tucson's Danelle Confair spoke with one of the volunteers on how they're helping out. It's a story you'll see only on 4. Red Cross volunteers from Tucson flew out on Friday in order to help the more than 20 people involved in the deadly crash in New Mexico. So the truck crosses the median, it jackknifes, and, it, and it, as it jackknifes, it goes into the uh, uh, westbound lanes of Interstate 40 and collides with the bus. On Thursday, killing eight people and injuring dozens. In response, two Tucson Red Cross volunteers flew out to help all of those involved. Dealing with the people in the hospital, finding out what they need. These people were taken from the bus with no clothing, without their phones, without their identification, and we are trying to help them get what they need so they can move forward. Also moving forward, an investigation into what caused the semi-trailer to crash. This is where our investigators uh, will look at the human factors issues. They'll look at driver fatigue issues, uh, medical fatigue, driver qualifications, uh, driver histories, uh, driver training and those kinds of things. Tucson volunteers helped organize Red Cross assistance with those involved. One volunteer even visiting the hospital to check on patients. I think mostly now it's emotional support. Uh, for these folks. The community in Gallup was just outstanding in terms of providing items of clothing, you know, and things that people needed right now. Tucson volunteers will be in New Mexico until Monday or Tuesday. For News 4 Tucson, I'm Danelle Confair.